Welcome back to this blissful living mantra. This is Priscilla, and today we're going to talk about breastfeeding because here where I live, or oh, internationally, it's actually breastfeeding week. So I believe if you're watching this, you are either a breastfeeding mom, you are almost a breastfeeding mom, or you are just finding out for the future. So um, I know <laughs> many people are against are against these weeks of breastfeeding of mental health of they are like what is a week going to do for us actually these weeks are there to um bring up awareness to congratulate people who are there going through that that stage of life okay so if you're a breastfeeding mom out there congratulations you are doing a good job continue 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 until you can't anymore okay and if you're not a breastfeeding mom you decided to use a bottle because you couldn't breastfeed because you didn't have enough milk or you just decided that breastfeeding wasn't working for you congratulations you are also doing a good job just make sure listen not everybody is going to breastfeed not everybody is going to give the bottle just pick a method that works for you and your child and just make sure you're doing your best okay. if you're a recently subscriber thank you thank you so much i really do appreciate you that you're always coming back and if you're new to this channel hello i am priscilla i talk about so many things i have been there thinking each and every video i'm doing i'm talking about so many niches eh? <laughs> so listen i can't i i don't seem to um put life into a niche right now because so much is going on around me and in me and all over so <laughs> until i get a niche i do i speak about life and living okay and living in god's goodness and presence so just join and please subscribe if you think this talks to you so before we get into my number one food please 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 this might help you increase your milk supply it is not an assurance if you've got problems with your milk supply please 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 seek help from a lactation um what are they called a lactation a uh, person okay your health caretaker your doctor your um pediatrician just seek help um just seek professional help okay so breastfeeding i'm going to give you three good foods that have worked for me so um just um to, to to allow you know why i'm talking about breastfeeding i've been breastfeeding for now four years i would say yes four years and it has been going well it has worked for me um and yes let me just give you the three foods my number one food is garlic um garlic really has worked for me i am normally a person who really loves garlic okay um it smells nice <laughs> before eating it and while eating it afterwards not that much but i just love garlic garlic has so so many nutrients try garlic in case you want to increase your milk supply just notice that garlic if the babies are really like new newborns it might trigger colic okay so <laughs> when you have got those sleepless nights behind you don't insert it like after three two months two and a half don't insert it then okay just make sure your baby is stable enough they are their bellies their little tiny babies are used to the milk they are okay flax seeds are packed with omega-3 fatty acids which actually your body doesn't produce and you need the fatty acids okay for you yourself as a mother but also for the baby okay now, the other benefit of flax seeds is um they have got estrogenic properties that will help you boost your milk supply number three is oatmeal listen oatmeal is just a superfood oatmeal is just one of those superfoods okay i think i would categorize it for the benefits it has with the benefits it's loaded with i will categorize it with the garlic like it's up there okay it has got it will provide you as a mother as a lactating mother it will provide you with iron um which you will definitely need because listen you're breastfeeding you have probably um just gotten the baby you are low 
on iron okay not every mother but many mothers are low on iron because through the bath you have lost so much um blood and um you just need the iron okay <laughs> for the energy you need the iron so just try oatmeals um they are very good for breakfast um even if in fact oatmeal even if you're not a mother just just put it into yourself do oatmeal every at least every second day for breakfast oatmeal and 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 milk just eat them like cereal just sick like just put them in a bowl overnight so that in the morning they are very very soft put in some bananas and just enjoy the benefits from oatmeal let me know in the comment section what other foods can someone use to boost their milk supply so talking about oatmeal and flax seeds let's get into this simple recipe it's a no bake recipe it has got oatmeal the flax seeds it has got a little bit of honey and peanut butter please be conscious in case you are allergic of the foods mentioned okay thank you so much and see you in my next video bye beautiful people for this simple recipe you're going to need oatmeal very simple oatmeal you're going to need flax seed you are going to need chocolate chips as you can see and you're going to need honey okay again um i am just using this product not because they're sponsored but because that is what works for me best okay and yes take products that you think are best for you are best for your child or your children <laughs>